hey guys welcome to my channel if you're joining me for the first time i'm athena and today i'm going to be doing a day in my life vlog the first thing i do is i get up i get my face washed and i brush my teeth so i can start the day today my husband is at home with me so i'm actually going to be washing out some baby clothes So this is Anif guys and in her household we divide the workload so that we can get things done. So he washed the bottles and he's now sterilizing them and yes I wash my baby bottle and sterilize them after every use. This is me on the outside washing the baby clothes. I know some persons are going to say you can wash it in the machine. But personally for me, I don't like mixing the baby clothes in the machine. And also, I don't like the smell of breast milk. So I prefer to use the blue soap to wash the clothes. Because I think it's the best at taking out the scent. And this is me hanging them out on the line so that they can sun dry. It was now time to do my morning pump. Now, I normally pump for 10 minutes. And I pump at the setting of two. This was from one breast. Um, my breasts don't produce the same amount of milk. And this is from the other breast. After I do that, I normally measure all the milk. My baby is drinking anywhere from 90 to 120 mils per feed. So that's how I bag all the milk. For each catch, we I will make a bottle for him and i'll also take aside breast milk in the bag for freezer storage i'm not sure why i'm building up this big freezer supply since i'm not planning to go back to work anytime soon but i do produce a lot and i don't want it to go to waste so i'm going to put it in the freezer When I'm storing my milk, I put the date and the time and I also put the volume so it's easy whenever anybody goes to grab the milk. Whenever we start to use freezer milk, we try to use the most outdated one. Then I had some cornmeal porridge for breakfast. If you know me, you know that cornmeal porridge is one of my favorite things and I have it with crackers. Growing up, I used to have porridge with bread, but then once I became an adult and I discovered tough crackers in, in porridge, I never went back because it's the best thing ever. And this is just me downing down the, the porridge. I then got started to prepare baby boy's bath. And I know some persons will say that they don't bathe their baby every day good for you i'm not telling you to do it but i do bathe him every day and i wash his hair every other day so this is me giving him a bath not his favorite time but this morning he's doing better i feel like the more he does it and gets into a routine the better he gets at it this is his fit for the day so he has a cute little pants and these cute little shoes now um, he has eczema so i use this cream on his skin and i also use 0.5 percent hydrocortisone cream and this was little man all ready to go i combed his hair and it was just so cute this is baby girl's outfit for the day and there she is telling everyone she's we then left because we we're going on the road the first stop is the airbnb i need to check on some stuff and then we're going to go get some food i am literally so over these guys who wipe glass in kingston because why is it raining and he's wiping the glass and we told him no and then after he was finished he was asking for money i'm like hell no so we stopped at the airbnb to make sure that everything was okay for the guests that was supposed to check in today and everything was looking good it was so clean and that's one of the things that guests will say about our airbnb it's always so clean always so cozy and always smelling good 
this is the landscape this is the outside so if you want to sit and relax in the cool shade you can I then stopped at the ATM machine to get some money and then we made our way to Starbucks to get some juice for me and baby girl. I got the mango dragon fruit refresher which is one of my fave and then I got a small one for Zenaya, which she was very excited about. I also got her a cake pop, but she really didn't like it. She loves cake, but I don't know why she didn't like the cake pop. We stopped at Tuesday and Bowl's Traction Records for lunch. I was so excited to be going on for the first time since the baby was born. And we chose here because we knew it would be empty because it's like 1 p.m. in the day. And this is an I working on her hard work. I ordered some soup to start, and the soup was delicious. For Zenaya, we got a pizza and uh, for myself, I got a pasta in tomato sauce and I got a pasta because I don't think anybody can spoil a pasta, but this was the worst pasta I've ever had in my life. I never thought I would ever say that, but it was really bad. Like, it was awful. I took a couple bites and then that was it for me. Like, it was not it and this is Zenaya enjoying her pizza like she really was enjoying it she actually wanted the chicken fingers but th that was old so we had to get her the pizza this was Anif's fish and it was so delicious like it looked good and when I tasted it it was really good like I literally could not stop but he was just complaining my food you realize I'm gonna edit out the voice right? I'm gonna edit out that one here more people know me I go through on a daily so that's pasta she not really like that is my food steamed fish and And I had all the pizza. Well, I took a slice and Anif took a slice, but she had the rest of pizza on her own. And that's Anif and Johnny's fish and refusing to share anymore with me. Because it was the same with Tracks and Records. Of course, they had sports going on on the TV, which was nice. You know, we were watching the champs while we were eating. And the place is really nicely decorated with images of Usain and so forth. The atmosphere was nice and this was the bill guys but I think it was worth it for the amount of food and then it was time to go home baby boy was fast asleep in the car and then I was also knocked out <laughs> When I got home, I decided to make myself a burger since my pasta was so bad. So I, ha I didn't have any lettuce or tomato because I ran out. It's almost the end of the month. But I used bacon and some pickle and some cheese and it was really good. Then it was time to go for our little even walk. So now we're just taking an evening stroll around the community so I can get a little exercise. And we're also going to stop at the park with Zenny so she can get a little playtime. This is Zenaya. She was having so much fun at the park. And I was just relaxing on the sideline with baby boy and then we got home and it was time to just unwind and just relax so we were watching school challenge kids together like we always like to watch school challenge kids together and basically just winding down 
Okay, so I just spent the last two hours trying to settle my son. It's crazy. My lower back is hurting me so bad. I'm exhausted. Um, I think he's going through a phase where he just doesn't know how to fall asleep and because of that he is like really fussy so once he's tired he gets really fussy and i just have to you know i'm trying today he was extremely fussy and when he needs to burp like he will scream your head off so yeah i just finished with that i'm going to I'm going to shower now and I'm going to try to prepare something light to eat from some crackers or so and then I'm going to try to get a nap. I don't know how Onif is feeling if he wants to go until 12, if no means to 10 so I could get a 2 off but if he's extremely tired I don't want to leave him with the baby because yeah I don't like that idea but we'll see what happens so I think I'm probably going to end the video there so Thank you for watching guys, until next time, peace out.